There are changes in leadership at several local police departments that were at the center of protesting during the past year. What's next in the process of filling these open police chief positions? Taylor Lumpkin has a closer look. After serving the Kenosha Police Department for more than two decades, Chief Daniel Miskinis is retiring from the force. And while many are sad to see him go, others argue that this move was long overdue. We're going to miss his leadership um, for, for quite a long time. In a recent email, Kenosha Police Chief Daniel Miskinis announced that after 25 years, he's decided to retire from the department at the end of April. He also wrote that the department is, quote, full of dedicated, talented and service minded people and that it's a department to be proud of and one I will miss. And I saw the man up front, uh, up close and personal, and I saw his dedication. I saw his professionalism. I saw him wanting to do the right things. For some, Miskinis' retirement didn't come as a surprise. Back in August, the American Civil Liberties Union, along with a number of other organizations, had called for the immediate resignation of Miskinis for his response to the protests following the Jacob Blake shooting, which ultimately led to the death of two protesters. I hold the, the police chief there in Kenosha, the, sheriff's, the sheriff in Kenosha, and also um, whoever was in charge of the National Guard when they were in Kenosha. I hold all of them accountable. Miskinis' announcement comes just two weeks after Wauwatosa's police chief, Barry Weber, announced that he would be retiring in June. Weber had also dealt with his fair share of scrutiny following the fatal shootings of three men by former police officer Joseph Mensa over the past three years. Until, um, you know, the community is in control of the police, we're not going to see genuine change. If they're serving the citizens, we should have a say and you know, how they're funded, how we're policed, and who's policing us. I'm told the police and fire commission are on the search for the next police chief, but until then, the deputy chief will be stepping into the position. Taylor Lumpkin, TMJ4 News.